Hi guys, welcome. Thanks for joining me. Today's uh, setup looks a little different. We've actually left the comfort of the green screen and we're here in the kitchen at the club. And we're here because today's activity involves cooking. I thought it'd be great for us to try a new recipe. And we're actually gonna be making mini pizzas. So I have in front of me laid out the ingredients that you'll need. I'm using English muffins, cause that's what I had. But you can also use a bagel if you'd like. And for the cheese, I didn't have any shredded mozzarella cheese, so instead I had these baby bell cheese and I just cut them up into small pieces. It'll work. I also have ham because I like ham on my pizza. And the other ingredient that you'll need is marinara sauce. So once you have all your ingredients in front of you, you, you can go ahead and start assembling your pizza. So the first step for you, and actually I'm gonna stand a little bit here, pardon my reach. Uh, the first step for you, what you'll want to do is um, spread your pizza sauce on your bread, bagel, uh, English muffin, whatever you have. After that, you can sprinkle on your cheese onto your bread. Make it look pretty. It's up to you. It's all going in the same place, so I'll make it look a little pretty. And then I'll add my ham. So we'll put our ham on here. Okay, so this is the uncooked um, product that we have, and if your parents let you use, the, or if you're old enough to use the oven, that's what we're gonna use. I have a toaster oven here at the club. I've got it set for 400 degrees, and it's gonna cook approximately 10 minutes. You'll wanna keep an eye on it, though, and uh, you might need uh, parent supervision if you're not old enough to use the oven. But we're gonna pop this bad boy in the oven and use whatever ingredients you have at home. If you have olives, throw those bad boys on there. If you like pineapple on your pizza and you have that at home, by all means, use whatever you have. And I'm gonna go ahead and pop this bad boy in our toaster oven. Again, it takes approximately uh, 10 minutes. You'll wanna keep an eye on it. I'm gonna uh, take a short intermission and I'll be back to show you our finished product. Okay guys, intermission is over. Here's our uh, finished product. It's nice and crispy. Bread is, our cheese is nice and melty. Ham is nice and toasty. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. I encourage you guys to try it at home. Again, we hope you guys are all staying healthy, stay inside, remember to wash your hands, and we hope to see you all soon.